Friday, October 9th on Nickelodeon. One hero and his crew, Lorelai and Tomas, aye, aye, will become pirate protectors. <laughs> but it won't all be smooth sailing. Oh. Join Santiago on epic aventuras that will make you say, This is blowing my mind. Santiago of the Seas, the brand new series, premiering Friday, October 9th on Nickelodeon. Hello, Nikki. Kevin, what's up? Hi, Jeff. Hi, Jeff. Nikki, you're in Puerto Rico? Oh, that's nice. Yep. I certainly am. <laughs> um, it, it, it's lovely right now. It's, it's beautiful and breezy and just nature all around. <laughs> So, Kevin, missing pirate treasure, Captain Calavera, how does the search go for the treasure? <laughs> well, Santi, energetic kid, energetic eight-year-old who just wants to embark on adventures, have a bunch of fun. And Cap Capitan Calavera was a past pirate who passed away, and he and Santiago he's found all of his things and kind of becomes the new pirate protector of the island. So he loves to, you know, go find treasures, and he doesn't keep them. He mostly gives it back to the rightful owner, tries to help out as much as he can, helps out everyone, and faces all the obstacles that come his way because of his pirate crew, because of his amazing team. And honestly, yeah, there's many villains that come his way and try to mess up everything. But at the end of the day, Santiago conquers everything. And even if the villains get into some trouble, Santiago's there to be their right hand. So he's a very helpful and kind-spirited and kind-hearted guy. And Kevin, there's a creature living in your head, Giko? Giko, that's right. <laughs> He's honestly the best, best sidekick you could ever have. If anything happens, if you throw something up in the air and you don't know where it went, Kiko sticks out his tongue and gives it back to you, honestly. He, he's amazing. He's the best, you know, little frog and best little creature you could have. He's super sweet and super, super, super cute. Uh, I feel like people are going to fall in love with him a lot. Nikki, tell me about finding the perfect theme song for Santiago of the Seas and the music in the show. I mean, listening to the music while watching the cartoon, I feel like I want a mojito. <laughs> um, <laughs> <okay>. <laughs> so um, we, we've been able to collaborate with, with a fair amount of amazing musicians. Our, our composer, Alfonso, just brought this incredible, authentic pirate a pirate vibe to to the score of the show while also integrating elements from Latino Caribbean genres like salsa, merengue, bachata. So it's it's a very unique version of of pirate music, I guess. Um and and we've got uh, Jolly Pop as well helping us out with with um songs that will be featured uh throughout of Santiago's adventures. So I hope everybody can tune in and have that music kind of stuck in their ears and singing along. <laughs> Kevin, take me through a typical recording session for Santiago of the Seas. Uh, rumor has it you can show up in your pajamas if you want to. To be honest, yes, you can. Yes, you can. <laughs> um, so basically, you you arrive, you go into the booth, and you warm up a little bit if you know if you feel like you need to. And that's mostly what we do. And then we start rehearsing, you know, we start going through the lines, we start recording, they start putting it all together, and all the lines are pre-recorded that day, and then they put it all together, they make it match the voice of Santiago, and it's honestly amazing, you know, you get into this separate booth and all the other, you know, um, like workers and all these other, you know, like editors and people are in another room attached, so they could hear you, they could give you directions if they need you to fix something, if you need to say something differently. They're there to help you out. So it's honestly the best environment. Now, Nikki, you know, Kevin is perfect for the voice of Santiago, but he's starting to sound like Santiago's older brother. <laughs> uh, but, you know, we, we've got some wonderful sound editors doing magic to make sure that, that Kevin continues to be our Santiago. <laughs> We make it work. Well, Kevin, Nikki, congratulations on Santiago of the Seas, and I uh, wish you the best of luck, and we'll talk again real soon. Thank you very Thank much. You. I appreciate it.